Hi, I'm Kent Seacrest here with Prairie Quilt, and so glad that you came to join us. We want to tell you, we finally got the FOF Creative Icon in. It's so exciting. We got them all in, the ones that are pre-ordered, so we're delivering those right now, and we're showing them to people as we get them in. It's so exciting. There are so many features on here. You know, they had the videos online, and the videos allowed you to get a sneak preview of what the machine will do. However, it does so much more than that. It does so much more. I'm going to show you some more things, but I got to tell you, I can't show you all of it because there's just that much. So let's just get into it and just start showing you. I got my personal machine that I'm getting set up here and we'll look at it together. So right away, I noticed it's just beautiful. I mean, I just fall in love with the machine looking at it because it's so pretty. It's got a beautiful 10 inch screen, which makes it easy to see everything you're doing. And the screen is a different technology than anything we've used in the past. And it allows for things like uh, pinch to zoom and swipe. So like when I go into the embroidery mode, let's say I want to pull up an embroidery. I touch my menu. And as I look through the design, see, just like I'm working on my smartphone, I can go to different categories and swipe through. I can give a little tap and down here at the bottom, it'll tell me the size of the design and how many stitches and how many colors are in it. And just like my smartphone, I can go through the machine and I can peruse them and touch them. And if I want to open it, I just do a long touch. It opens on the screen. Look how big and beautiful that is. Now I've got this menu in my way. I can just touch that button right there and it goes away. There we go get it out of my way that's kind of nice and that's just one wonderful thing the big beautiful screen what else does it have one of the things they've really improved that i really like is the needle threader it automatically will thread the needle for us so let's show you how that works so we take our thread and we run it over here now and cut it and then when we touch a button it threads the needle completely on its own which just makes it easier, takes out the, the mistakes I make trying to thread my needle. One wonderful thing is, is when the bobbin runs out, it's, it's just no fun anymore, but this bobbin won't run out as often. It's a new larger bobbin. So that's the good news and the bad news. It's a 30% larger bobbin, holds more thread, so that means more sewing before you run out of thread. I just love that feature. It's still the same design, so it can only go in one way and it can only wind one direction, so you can't make a mistake when you wind. And yes, you can still wind a bobbin while you embroider and use a separate spool for winding and a separate spool for sewing, and it will, you can wind all your bobbins while you're embroidering. It's a wonderful feature. Something else I really love is this thread stand they added. We now have the ability to use cone-type threads and right there on the machine have the telescope. So the thread comes off the top of the spool and the telescope. What a wonderful feature that is. Of course, one of the biggest features people have been asking for is more embroidery space. So now we have between our needle and the inside arm of our machine, 10.2 inches of embroidery area. And that's embroidery hoop, the new large hoop is right here. This is the new hoop, it's 14 inches long by 10.2 inches wide. And that really allows you to do a large space, like a whole jacket back without having to re-hoop. That's a wonderful feature. But then also the sewing area is 12 and a quarter inches over. So we've got a longer arm for doing free motion and sewing. So sewers will really enjoy that. Another really big feature sewers will enjoy is right up here up close, you can see the feed dogs, how we have three new slots in the front. If you look at your current FOF model, you won't see this. Um, and there's three sets of teeth there that all fabric that's in front of the needle. So if you start on the edge of your fabric, will be fed much better now with this new design because of these new teeth here. Not only that, they've added more teeth on the whole feed dog. Another wonderful feature they've added is they've raised the height here so you have more visibility. There's a full three inches of room and they've shaved back the front of the machine. It's not as big and bulky. So you have a lot more visibility in your sewing area. We just love that feature. 
One of the things, you know, they improved on everything on this machine. They improved on the IDT, the built-in walking foot. And if you look at it, the resting place for it is raised higher and more out of the way. So your fabric and your project is less likely to get caught on it now when it's not being used. But when you do use it, it is now redesigned to be driven by a motor. So it's actually going to be more powerful, and it is more powerful. It has more pressure on the teeth, and there's more teeth that it comes in contact with on the bottom feed teeth, so it does a better job of feeding. Everybody at convention and the girls here in the store that are sewing on this machine really are noticing the difference in the IDT, that built-in walking foot, how powerful it is, and that's one of the wonderful things about the Foff Creative Icon, and any Foff for that matter, is that built-in walking foot. We really love it. One of the really great things we love about this machine is the fact that all your feet and all your hoops and all your accessories from any of the faucets that are in the line now you bought will work on this. However, there is one thing that won't. We talked about that, the bobbins. That's the good news is the bobbins won't work and the bad news is the bobbins won't work. Why is it good news? Because they're bigger. They're not that expensive to get bobbins and they're bigger. So who wouldn't like that? One thing that I really like that's new, I'm gonna put down the thread stand here. I can just click that down, shut this and show you the new handle. Not that that's a big deal, but it's, it's all the way across the machine so it's easier to grip and get your balance on. But this purple along here, this is a rubber strip. So you really feel like you have a good grip when you grab your handle. Not only that, but the hand wheel on the end is rubberized as well. So that's nice and easy to grip. So you feel like if you do want to turn the hand wheel, which you don't really need too often, but if you do, you've got a nice feeling of that you really have a good grip on it. Something else they've added, when you want to change the speed of the machine in the past, we've gone through a menu in the machine. Now we actually have a physical slider on the end of the machine here. So uh, we can change the speed here just by sliding that slider and we can do it while we're working with the machine. We don't have to go into a menu to change what we're going to do. One thing that I think stood out to me and as well as uh, other people that have used the machine is how intuitive this user interface is. Like down here at the bottom, you got your hearts, which is your, your favorite, you got home and then you got your windows. So I'm gonna hit the home button and this is like when you first turn it on. Let's say you get home with your new machine and you wanna know how to use it. You open your help center and you've got these categories. Well, let's just say when you get home, you want to get started. So you hit get started and you have these questions that we're going to answer. Well, the first thing you're going to want to know to do is how to thread the machine. So when you touch that, it will bring up the category on right here on how to thread the machine. There's a video if I touch that and it'll play me a video of how to thread the machine. Now, one thing about threading a machine or watching a video on learning how to use anything is if you watch a really long video, but you only want to know about one part of it, you have to watch the whole video again to find that one part. Well, these videos are broken up in little pieces. See how it stopped with a lot of the video left to go because that first part is what this is. So I, if I wanted to watch the next part, I would go here and I would scroll to the next part and I would hit that video. Well, that seems kind of cumbersome if you wanna watch the whole video for the first time. So what you do in that case, you touch this button right here and it allows you to watch the whole video without having to watch each little segment or you can watch each little segment. Just a really thoughtful feature that has been added to the machine. I really like. So you can see there how to thread it exactly. The, the animations they used are very clear and very easy to follow to help you be successful when learning the things the video shows. So the machine has many videos built in. One of my favorite features that this machine has is a new powerful motor. It's not just 10% more powerful or 20% more powerful. It's actually 90% more powerful. Now we have always demoed the Foff Creative Icon or the Foff Creative Machines before this with several layers of denim and it handles it very well, especially with a built-in walking foot. Well, this one is 90% more powerful. Let me talk to you about that and let you know what, I'm, what that means. So I've got a little something here I'm gonna to use to demonstrate 
uh, how powerful that is. And that is, uh, I do woodworking and I've got this screwdriver and it'll drive screws. And like this is a screw here, as long as I'm screwing the skinny part of the screw in, it's pretty easy to turn. But when I get to the head and the head starts to go into the wood, it becomes harder to drive. Well, screwdrivers today, some of them have this feature, it's an impact driver, that it will draw on extra power and get more powerful and do it something they call hammer. Or, um, oh, there's another word, I can't think of what it is right now, but anyway, it begins to hammer and you can hear it knocking, but it's pulsing more power and it allows it to drive and have more power. I'm just gonna demonstrate that here with these screws. I'm gonna do two of them and you can hear it just whirring in until the head of the screw meets the wood then it begins to hammer and let you see that and the reason i am is because of the fall creative icon does that same thing it has this ability to hammer so if you're sewing a purse with handle straps and then you've got really thick handle straps and then you got it doubled over and you're sewing a d-clip on and it gets really thick this machine is not going to come up with a message that says motor needs to rest it's going to turn on go power and get it done. Let me show you what I mean. So I'm gonna screw this screw in here. You hear that extra power that's putting out there? Here we go, I'll do another one. It sounds like a hammer. Well, that's what it is. It's actually hammering that screw in, pulsing it with extra power to get it through. Well, this machine has that same feature. And I just think that's wonderful that it does that because that allows us to sew anything we want and not have it stall. Now the machine, do you need that all the time? No, but when you do, don't you want it? <laughs> See what I mean? It's really awesome. Now they've also improved the thread cutter to where they've actually redesigned it completely and I am impressed. They've improved all the parts on it. They're all metal now when they were plastic in places before which worked fine but the metal now is going to be even better and one thing you may notice is it's got a larger stitch plate and that larger stitch plate still just snaps off like the pro did but it's bigger so you have even more guides all the way out you have metric here on the front you have inches on the back and it goes out to two and a half inches on each side from the needle which is really clever they really thought that through now I gotta just reiterate, this machine has a ton of features that I can't even begin to show you because there's just too many and I don't wanna, I can't take that much time on a video to show you everything, but I'm gonna show you something else I just think is really wonderful. I'm just gonna go into sewing here and I'm going to go choose a stitch, open up a menu there, there we go. And now I have the, across the top here, see the different categories there, how it scrolls across. Like if I wanted to choose techniques, touch it. And then I have all my techniques here. So this is single ribbon stitches. I have double ribbon stitches, triple ribbon stitches, stacking stitches, floating stitches, radiant stitches. Let's say I want to do a radiant stitch and so I select it. When I do give it the quick tap, it gives me the instructions here on how to do a radiant stitch right there at the stitch. Now that came up because I did a quick tap. Let me close that and show you again if I do a quick tap or a, a long tap, it'll pull it up, see? Uh, the new machine now has the ability to open any size USB stick. I've got a 64 gigabyte here, I've got a 16 gigabyte in it and it opens it right up. So I just go to the file manager, I go to USB device, I go to an embroidery design and they're on here and listed in by name. I can touch this button, it'll list them by picture. I can touch and hold, or touch quickly, I mean, and get the size of the design, the number of stitches, the number of colors, or I can do a long touch and actually get it to load the design in the screen right there, just like that. So there's so many features. I'd love to go on and on. Hopefully we'll get to make some more videos. But for day, I, today, I just want to give you an overview, some of the really cool things we've seen and learned about the machine. And if you get a chance to see it in person and touch it, you will really be impressed. I know this is the most impressive sewing machine I've ever laid my eyes on. And I'm really excited to get mine home after we're done showing. I can take it home 
and I look forward to helping you get yours. Thanks for seeing me. Bye.